Hi thoughties and welcome back to my crazy ass channel. How are y'all doing today? I hope you are doing amazing. Want a Timbit? So today we are going to be doing something which I would love to do in real life but have never been given the opportunity, you know? I think it's a little bit too late for me to start out this challenge in real life and make no fucking progress, but today we are going to be playing bit life, but bitch, we are going to be playing it differently. We are going to be playing bit life with only one rule this time. I'm only allowed to make money from men. Mm-hmm. Stealing all the sugar daddy's money, marrying them, killing them, or just asking them for a shit ton of cash. All right, whichever one comes first. Now, I think Exeroid was actually the first person to do this challenge, so I will have his channel linked below. He is so hilarious, and he actually just hit 10,000 subscribers. So let's go ahead and congratulate him and join his team, okay? Link in the description, but let's go ahead and pop right into this. Okay. All right, so I was playing BitLife a little bit because there's a pet update and it's really fucking cool, but unfortunately, we're gonna end this life, okay? I'm just fucking ending it because we gotta start all over. So, rest in peace, blah, 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 wasteful. That's not very nice, but okay. Let's go ahead and start a new life, bitch. I hope I'm pretty as hell. I just need to be gorgeous and have big titties so that I can steal all the money, but okay. Three, two, one, let's see. Oh, I'm a male. This isn't gonna work. I can't steal money from my own gender. Surrender. Goodbye. All right, so I finally got a suitable life. This took fucking forever. Okay, my name is Gabriella Bellini. I was born a female in Turin, Italy. I was a result of an affair. Okay, so we spicing this up already. I bet my mama was chasing the bag trying to get a sugar daddy, period. So, it looks like I have a father, a mother, and a half-brother, actually. Okay, so, moment of truth. Does my dad got money? Let's see. Uh, oh, it looks like he does. Okay, so this is going to start out pretty good. So what I'm going to do is just age up a little. No, are you fucking kidding me? I finally get the perfect life and I get cancer of the fucking kidney. Okay, let's see if they can cure my cancer. Please cure my cancer. But if not, I, I don't know. Treat my cancer. No luck. Oh, no. What about the other doctor? Can the other doctor cure my cancer? No luck. Ugh. No, I'm probably just going to die. Oh my god, this is sad, but yeah, I just died of um cancer of the kidneys, so that really sucks. But okay, I guess let's start another fucking life. You know what? Let's do this differently, actually. Let's go ahead and do a new life and make our name Christina Bag Eulera, okay? Because that's just what I'm about. I'm about the bag, so... Let's be female, be born in the United States, and let's go to the land of fucking Hollywood, bitch. Los Angeles, California. Begin life. Okay, my stats are actually really good. I was born female in Los Angeles, United States. I was conceived on a camping trip. That is so romantic and so fucking Hollywood. I don't really go camping over there. They just do cocaine. Okay, it looks like I have a father and a mother and no siblings, but let's see. Do you got money? My dad, you know, he seems to have a little bit of money, so that is perfectly fine. Now... We're just going to age up a little bit just because obviously I'm too young to ask for any money, but I am now eight years old. Ooh, a girl has been telling everyone you have slept with everyone on the diving team. Bitch, I'm eight years old. What the hell? Go spread something else. What? I'm reporting her to my teacher. That is weird. <gasps> the bully assaulted you. Bitch, I'm fighting back. You assaulted the bully. You busted her jugular. Did she die? Oh, she didn't die, but I just beat her ass. Oh, and I randomly have a sister now? Okay. I told her she's pretty fly. She didn't really appreciate that, but that's okay. So, I think we're gonna start by asking my daddy for some money. Uh, $2? I'm just trying to figure out what the fuck I can get for $2. Dad, are you kidding me? $2. Maybe if I go to the movies with him, he'll like me more and spend all his money on me, but $2? I'm gonna have to trade my dad in. But okay, if he won't give me money, maybe he'll give me a pet. So let's go ahead and check out the pet update. Let's go to the animal shelter. And it looks like we have a lot available. Oh my God, there's so many puppies and kittens. So let's try to get, are there any puppies? I don't think so, but let's try to get Maya, the mutt. Oh wait, she's she really doesn't have a lot of health. Her health isn't that good, so let's try Jackson. He's cute. Your parents refuse to get you the mutt named Jackson. I'm squaring up with my parents. Look at what they did to my health and my happiness. 
I need a pet in order to live. Ugh, this is just so unfair. I'm gonna kill my dad later on in life. I just know it. But okay, I guess, oh no, I have depression? <gasps> Look at what my parents are fucking doing to me. Okay, I'm going to go to the doctor. She clearly didn't want to get rid of my depression or help me at all. You're not currently suffering from any conditions. It just told me I was. But okay, maybe if I try to make some friends or if I go to the movie theater, go see that. I'll be a little bit happier maybe. I just need a pet. That's all I fucking need to cure my depression. Give me Cupcake, the alley cat. No, your parents refuse to get you the cat named Cupcake. Why? I'm such a good kid. I deserve a kitty cat. Now I got mumps. What the fuck? These lives are just not going very well. Okay, treat my mumps. There we go. I think I'm just gonna have to age up a little bit until I can become a little bit older, get a boyfriend, start taking his money. Okay, well, I'm no longer suffering from depression, but now I got pneumonia, which is pretty serious, I think. I don't know. So I'm going to go back to the doctor. We've been to the doctor a lot lately. I'm all cured, and now, can I get a pet? Please give me a fucking pet beat. Pet store, what's in here? A bunny, can I get a bunny? Oh, I don't have $18, fuck. Okay, what if I ask my dad for a little bit more money, please? One dollar? That's less than you gave me when I was a toddler. What the fuck am I going to do with one dollar? I have three dollars to my name. I just need more sugar daddies. Okay, let's get a boyfriend to start leeching off of. So, you're tempted to ask out a boy from school named Alexander Murphy. Let's do it, go for it. Oh, he called you a fatty, are you kidding me? Why would anyone ever call me fatty, I don't know. Okay, he's not the one for me, fine. Let's find somebody else. Oh, he crazy, he'll go for me. He rejected me too, what the fuck? I hate this game. Okay, let's ask you out. Call me a biznatch. What the fuck is a biznatch? I am Christina Baguilera and I'm just trying to get rich. I'm trying to get money. I'm trying to get men and they're all saying no. <gasps> you are not going out with Joey Alexander. Fuck yes. Or as Christina Baguilera would say, yeah. Okay, that was really bad. Okay, Joey, let's get to know you and um, your stats. Looks like it doesn't say anything about his money, but let me compliment him a little bit. Ooh, I'm groovy. Okay, you only see one side of me, but all right. Um, have a conversation with him. And how about we spend a little bit of time together, okay? I just really don't want him to break up with me. They normally break up with you really fast, you know. See? I knew it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. But I'm going to beg him to stay. Yes, he decided to stay with me. Okay, pussy so good, he got my name on it. Okay, what does this roadside mean? I have no idea. I don't have my fucking driver's license. Does that mean one-way sharp curve or nitro boost? I'm gonna go with, um, one-way. Oh, I failed. Well, fuck it. Now, Joey, honey, I'm just going to try to get him to like me a little bit more. And then I'm going to steal his money, you know. Okay, moment of truth. Ask for money. Oh, your boyfriend Joey said he is broke. Damn, why am I messing with a broke dude? But he's trying to break up with me again and he's broke, so I think that's fine. I'm just gonna insult him one last time and move on with my life to bigger and better men. I can't use the dating app until I have more money, so I'm just gonna work on getting another boyfriend. He called me an inbreeder, what the fuck? I'm not inbred, but okay, I'm dating this guy called Lewis now, and I'm just hoping he has a little bit more money than my past relationship. So I'm just gonna spend some time with him, and I'm gonna need to get about $100 so that I can use the dating app, okay? I can't get a real job. All I can do is steal money from men. Apply for college. Y'all wish. College is not for me. I'm doing a sugar daddy style, you know. Let's compliment him again. And, ooh, he really liked that. I think he's going to give me money. Definitely. Let's try to propose. Oh, that's awkward. Okay, since you rejected me, will you give me money? Oh, he's broke. What the fuck? I really know how to pick him, don't I? But okay, the tea is that I'm 18 years old and I have about $3 to my name. Not very good, but I'm gonna have to find a way to get money. So let's just keep complimenting my boyfriend, try to get him with me and ask my dad for more money. Oh, $4, what an improvement. I can't ask my mom because it's a sugar daddy challenge. Let's see, can I get a job as a stripper? Does that work? Does that count? Oh no, there's no stripper or escort job. Fuck, what about massage therapist? Does that count? No, I don't think that counts. I mean, I would be like, you know, massaging the daddies, hand jobs under the table, but unfortunately, it doesn't count. I'm the one that made this challenge and I think I made it way too hard, but okay. <sighs> Please, I need my boyfriend to get rich. Okay, I'm just going to age up one, I'm pregnant. Okay, well that means he's going to marry me for sure. I'm keeping the baby. Keeping my baby. Okay, I don't even have enough money to get married to him, so this this is just not gonna work, but let's give birth. Um, 
Aisha has been born. Okay, let's see. Ask for money. Your boyfriend Lewis refused to give you any money. Okay, well, let's see if... No, he's literally refusing to give me money. This is horrible. Why is my dad so broke? Everybody's refusing to give me money, so I'm canceling the engagement and I'm breaking up with you. I'm sorry, I'm just done. I have seven fucking dollars, you guys. This is horrible, but okay, I need to find a date. How much money is the dating app? A hundred dollars, how am I supposed to get that? Oh, okay, I'm dating this guy called Marcus Elliott. I'm just gonna try to woo him again, get this relationship popping, go to the movie theater, and try to get him to love me, okay? I'll be right back. Your boyfriend Marcos said he couldn't help you. Also, I'm in a little bit of a crisis right now. My bank account is negative $1,993. I have no fucking money, bitch. No money. Okay, I'm sorry. I need to get a job. I need to. I'm gonna get whatever I can take. Literally anything. Let's try to be like a receptionist or something like that, okay? Now I have $2,000 and kidney stones. I immunized my daughter. I'm breaking up with my boyfriend. I'm just done with him. Let's try to set up a threesome. Oh no. Your boyfriend Marcos is not interested in having a threesome. Well, fuck you Marcos. I'm going for the old men now. So, what I'm going to do for this is I'm just gonna use a dating app to find an old man and then I guess I'm gonna give the rest of my money away since I wasn't supposed to get a job in the first place and I cheated but whatever pick your desired age 80 plus let's see no one what so I waste a hundred dollars for nothing okay 70 to 79 it doesn't matter no one what oh my god where are the fucking old men I need you in my life <gasps> an old man okay Brendan swallow so he gonna be swallowing a lot of shit so oh yeah I have to quit my job I completely forgot resign what else can I do I guess have a conversation and he wants to buy a car um girl I'm negative $26 are you dumb let's see if he'll marry me propose <gasps> he said yes are you serious oh my god but now the thing is I don't have enough money to have a wedding so I'm gonna try to ask him for money and he fucking denied it are you kidding me okay back to getting a shitty job so I can pay for this shitty fucking wedding <gasps> porn actor no I'm too ugly to be a porn star are you kidding me okay we're gonna work on plastic surgery and be a porn star too but okay damn I'm fired after one year of work okay at least I got seven thousand dollars it's all good I'm just such a shitty worker but okay what we're going to do is go ahead and get married to my first husband let's get married in a fucking barn bitch yeehaw his net worth is a hundred and ninety thousand dollars so I'm just going to agree to sign the prenup because we already know he's gonna die don't worry and I'm keeping Mrs. Bagulera because that's just so good. Christina Bagulera never backs down, bitch. Let's have a baby. What? I failed to get pregnant. Oh my god, his powdery nut is just not working out. Have a baby. Come on. Oh my god, wait, am I like infertile? I don't know. I'm pregnant. Okay, yes. And I kind of want to get a puppy. I mean, I should be spending my money very responsibly, but I'm too poor to have a dog. Well, that sucks. I'm about to have my second child, so this isn't very responsible, but okay. What? I lost my baby. Oh my god, that is so sad when that happens, but I'm going to try again, see if I can get pregnant, and just get him to love me enough to give me money. Okay, so I managed to give birth. My son is called Tyrese, I think, or Caleb. Okay, whatever. Caleb Swallows. What a great name. Now I'm going to ask for some money. <gasps> my husband gave me $200. Fuck yes. What about my daddy, daddy? Will you give me money? Oh, your father told you to stop asking for money. Well, fuck you, dad. How much money am I going to inherit? Do my parents have money? Not really. That sucks. Oh, man. Okay, how old is my fiancé? Let's see. Or my husband, I guess. 64. So, I'm gonna give him five more years of life, and if he survives, I'm killing him. One year of life? Today, while napping on the couch, I heard my mom talking about how she recently learned what scissoring is. Okay. Didn't need to know that. Two. Ooh, Brendan retired. That means he's gonna die soon. Three. Oh, my dad died. Fuck yes. I hated my dad. He didn't give me no money. I'm gonna turn the light on. Hang on. Four. Oh, nothing happened. And five. Did he die? No, he didn't. So, it looks like my bank balance. Oh my god. Negative $16,000.
bitch, this is not going good. I think it's time to kill my husband once and for all. And this is probably gonna give me, this is probably gonna take a couple tries, but I'm, I'm going to kill him, period. Okay, ha ha ha, kill someone. A random illegal immigrant, what? Wait, why can't I kill him? He's literally not on the list, that's so annoying. Wait, what if I try to rob someone or commit Grand Theft Auto? Let's try. What should I go for? I don't know car breeds, so I really don't know which car is the most expensive and exotic, but let's go for a Porsche. Steal it. You tried to steal the Porsche Cayenne, but an airline pilot saw you and called the cops. Oh fuck, well that didn't happen. That was easy. You successfully stole the Audi A5, bitch. I'm balling out here. <gasps> I also just spilled iced coffee all over my lap. I'll be right back. Okay, so let's see how much I can sell this Audi A5 for. Oh, whoops. Cars, Audi A5. I can sell it for $29,000. So sell it on the black market. No, no one wants to buy it, fuck. Also, if I age up right now, I'm about to be in even more debt. I'm thinking of just abandoning my children. Should I do it? I mean, they're putting me into fucking debt and this isn't about babies, it's about sugar daddies. Okay, so I'm sorry, I'm abandoning my children. Goodbye, Aisha. And goodbye, Caleb. See you later, bye. Okay, age up. <gasps> My husband wants a divorce. He tells you that you and your depression are too much to handle. I'm begging him to stay. Okay, he stayed with me, but I'm only here for the bag, okay? I would never stay with somebody like that in real life, and neither should you, but let's go ahead and sell it. No, I only got $18,000 for my Audi. Oh no, I'm still in debt. Okay, ugh. Husband, should I just like compliment him? Our relationship is so bad, but I'm just trying to get him to stay with me before he dies Or I could just try to kill him right now. Okay, let's try to kill him It's probably gonna take me a little bit again my I'm going to kill my husband by clubbing him. Oh, he died now Please don't tell me the cops got called three two one no, the cops got called okay swipe up. Oh, okay Well, I just tried to kill him for like 10 minutes. I mean zero progress. So I guess I'm just gonna have to wait until he ages up and dies. Oh, all I got was $20,000? What happened to the 190,000 that he had? Oh my God, this is horrible, but okay, at least I'm not in debt anymore. So what I'm going to do is just basically the exact same fucking thing, but let's try to find an older man this time, one that will die within a year. Like you, a retired hairdresser. He doesn't have hella money, but better than nothing. So what I'm going to do is just try to marry him right away. I call him Pimp Daddy. He was kind of like, what the fuck does that mean, you weirdo? But yeah, I'm just gonna try to marry him real quick, but going to the movie theater and all that jazz and okay let's try this out let's propose <gasps> he said yes okay perfect it is so easy to get old men to marry you in this game hello focus thank you but we're just going to go ahead and plan our wedding let's get married at a restaurant with no honeymoon at five thousand dollars bitch goodbye we'll go to church with no honeymoon okay. all right so i somehow got this dude to want to marry me and he wants me to sign a prenup or actually no it doesn't look like he wants me to but his net worth is ninety thousand dollars so don't mind if i do we got married and i feel like now he's just going to die right away so three two one are you dead oh no itchy bottom he gave me an std okay i feel like he's gonna die oh Pregnant by a fucking 90 ass year old man. Okay, I guess I'm keeping it even though I abandoned my two other kids But okay age up. Are you fucking dead yet? Hello. He's still alive. Oh my god. I'm asking for money $81 that's it. How the fuck is that child support bitch? Also look at my kitty kitty look hi Aren't you so cute? Mm-hmm. He literally needs to fucking die. I'm 37 years old and I don't even have 100 grand yet. Like, ugh. Okay, I'll have some whiskey, whatever. Can he just die? Like, what the fuck? Oh, he finally died. $64,000, baby. Now, darling, it's time to do the exact same thing over and over and over again. Fuck. Well, I was working on this dude trying to marry him, but he died before I could, so rip. Okay, so my new boyfriend wants to have a threesome, so of course I'm going to do it, bitch. Oh, okay, not too bad. Your boyfriend Samuel has left you for Amanda Clinton. Are you fucking kidding me? Amanda Clinton just stole my bag, bitch. Oh my God, I'm going to murder both of them. I would steal another car, but like that's not the whole point of this game. I just need a sugar daddy. Like, oh my God, I'm starting to get old. I'm in my 40s and I don't even have the bag yet. Come on, 80 year old men. Let's get sickening. I'm dating Jacob Smelly. So if he stink, maybe he'll want to, you know, get up in my pussy. That smells just as bad. But let's go ahead and just try to marry him because again, I'm fucking trying here. I am fucking trying, bitch. 
Okay, propose. Oh, he rejected me, are you fucking kidding me? I hope he drowns. Well, he said yes, finally, a year later, but let's have this fucking wedding in a barn with no honeymoon and do it. Oh, his net worth is $83,000, so we don't need a prenup, and he really doesn't have as much money as I wanted. Like, I just need a sugar daddy with like a million dollars. Is that too much to ask for? But he died literally the next year, so that's good. I got $80,000 from that. And now, again, come on, where are the rich ass dudes? Like, is there a fucking elite dating app or something like that? Oh, he looks like he got money. Okay, that's at least 100K right there. So again, same thing, just going with the compliments, the good pussy days, you know, you just gotta win these old dudes over. Over, the only way that you know how. Oh my god, I have a granddaughter from one of my abandoned kids. How cute. What's his name again? Okay, DeMarco. Baby, I know I've only known you for a couple months, but will you marry me? I swear it's not just for your money. I love you for you. Yeah! He bought it. Okay, perfect. He bought it. I'm so fucking happy. Now let's go ahead and have the wedding again at, uh, you know what? How about a drive through wedding chapel and get married? Oh, he wants me to sign a prenup, but that's okay because he's going to die and we're going to get it anyways. So agree to sign the prenup and now we wait for him to die. While on a trip to the mall, you witness a tourist throwing beer bottles into uncommon traffic. Bitch, look the other way. I don't care. I injured my mouth while having sex. It took eight weeks to heal. Mood. DeMarco, baby, are you dead yet? 94 years old. It's only a matter of time. Hello, son. Hell fucking yes. Your husband, DeMarco, passed away at the age of 100. Okay, and I got $256,000. This is starting to go good, okay? I'm getting a fucking puppy, bitch. You can't stop me. You know what? I'm going to just adopt the entire fucking animal shelter right here. Adopt you. Betty is here. I need to just get all the pets. Y'all can get out of the shelter. I got the money for you. Don't worry. I got you. You don't have the space for any more pets? No. I just want all the babies, but okay. I got three dogs, so I'm happy about that, but it's time to get like a fifth husband. I've lost track. Um, Let's go ahead and go back on the dating app. I just live here, bitch. I live here. Now, darling, all we need to do is win him over as well very easy again these old dudes only want one thing just a tiny tiny bit of attention but a lot of pussy and guess what i got a whole gaping hole for you bitch it's a lot so perfect right over here and now i'm just going to propose yay i told you it's so easy to get an old dude oh my god look at his net worth hell yes okay i'll agree to sign the prenup because it's gonna die Christina Bagulera, get in the bag, bitch. Now, keep Miss Bagulera again, and I guess I'll just wait for him to die. He's 70 years old. I am, how old am I? 57, so I'm guessing it'll maybe take him like 10 to 20 years to die. So, I'll catch you when it's that time. He died a fucking year later. Hell yes! He died of cirrhosis in the liver. Fuck. I'm happy. I got almost $900,000. Attend his funeral. I'm a millionaire. Mm-hmm. I snap. I'm just gonna keep doing this. Like, this is just so much fun. Fucking stealing old men's money. Just like this. Another dude that has easily a million dollars. This is just so good. Compliment him. Spend time with him. And I just want him to love me. Have a conversation. Blur, blur, blur. Propose. Yes, he, uh, oh my gosh, this is so easy. He's literally my, literally already my fiance. You know what, let's go to France. We're just gonna do a nice big wedding for this one because we haven't had anything fun and I can finally afford it. So let's go to France for my fucking thing. Okay, his net worth is 500,000. I'll take it. It's not a huge chunk, but I'll take it. We don't need a prenup because he's going to die. Let's see, how old is he? 81, so he'll be dead very soon. Oh, there he goes, deadbeat man. Thank you for the money. <gasps> no! Your Shih Tzu Sonic died at the age of eight. He died from chocolate poisoning after he ate some chocolate fudge. I don't even like chocolate. I would never leave that out. Are you kidding me? Oh my God, my doggy. <sighs> no, my other dogs are gonna be so sad. We need to get more. Hello, animal shelter. I'm back. Give me this dog. Thank you. Okay, y'all. So now we are looking at potentially the richest sugar daddy I've had so far. As you can see, his name is Buddy Pickles and his money is all the way out. So we're going to inherit a good amount. So let's first ask him for money. Oh, what an asshole. Whatever. We're just going to marry him real quick, just like this in a golf course. We'll go to Columbia for the thing. And his net worth is $1.4 million. So I'm just going to say we don't need a prenup. And we're just going to wait for him to die again, bitch. This is just the most money. Yeah! Oh, no! I mean, no! Oh, my 
my god, I literally thought that it was my husband that died and I got the bag, but it was my dog that died. My doggy. Oh my god, I'm sad. And my other dog died too. Why can't my husband die? Fuck. You know what? Let's see the exotic pet dealer because I haven't looked at that yet. Let's see. How was a fucking, oh, a sphinx cat? I guess it's kind of exotic. I was expecting like a lion or some shit, but okay. Can my husband die? Are you dead yet? Oh, my dogs are dying. Give me more pets. Come on. A coyote named Muse. Okay, I am going to be a coyote mother. I don't care. I, I had a coyote as a pet. Beautiful. Uh oh, my husband doesn't like that, but that's okay. Um, I'll just apologize. Can he die? Like, is my husband dead yet? Come on. I don't care if I have anxiety and depression. I'm rich because my husband died. Hell yes. Okay, well, I mean, we made $3.3 million, but I'm kind of bored of the whole sugar daddy thing now, so I think I'm ready to die. Actually, let's just get a shit ton of plastic surgery because what else? We'll get a lot of work done so that we look beautiful for our funeral and we'll just live life alone I guess my fucking facelift got botched so bad that I'm now at 0% looks bitch I'm just so mad right now. I'm kind of waiting to die at this point. Oh my cat died I have E. coli just like oh there we go. You died at the age 73. You died of complications from old age, but I got 3.3 million dollars. So bitch, I was rich. I snapped. I'm really happy about this. So yeah, that was my experience with only making money off of sugar daddies and bit life. I would love to see you guys do this challenge as well. Be sure to tweet it to me if you want to make a video on your channels. I would love to see it. Just like tag me in it or whatever you want to do. But yeah, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. I thought it was a really fun idea to try out and I really liked it. I just love money. Can't you tell? But alright, again, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Talk to me in the comment section down below and subscribe if you have not already and I will talk to y'all tomorrow. So, goodbye thoughties!